At the moment, um, I'm preparing the foyer uh, to put wood panelling around. So it'll go on the wall here like this. Um, I've just had to move the electrical plugs um, up this much because they were going to be in the, the top rail of the wood panelling. Um, so the power's off. So uh, anyone watching wondering why there's exposed wires here, uh, those uh, wires are, are turned off and uh, I'm working um, in a safe environment so uh, I just need to cut a few more of these boards so um, not really exciting So with any woodworking, uh, you need to know that you've got a square end so that you're working from a, a set um, uh, angle. So um, I just measure these very roughly because um, there's a tolerance of a few millimetres so we don't have to worry too much. And then just using our set square to make sure that the cut is uh, a... Um, a square, so do this way. Clamp it so we know it's not going to move, hopefully. Make sure it's clear underneath and One of the things I've been postponing because it was raining and I didn't need to water the garden is uh, fix a leak in the, the pipes of the, the water pipes going to the vegetable garden. So the, I turned the tap, uh, the tap off, but I noticed uh, over the last weeks that there was a wet patch around here. And I suspect one of the junctions of the pipe has uh, either popped out or burst in the, the winter. So I'm, uh, I'm going to check this out. And as I'm uh, lazy, I'm taking my, uh, my uh, big uh, drill to dig a hole, because I can't be bothered to do it manually. So I think the leak was around here. Anything so far? I have an electric uh, pipe. Let it 
shouldn't be what's leaking water. We have a junction here and I suspect it's what's been leaking. Oh yeah. So yeah, there's um the there's a brass junction here and it uh, broke and split open here. Well, that's impressive. I wonder how that happened. Because usually uh, brass junctions are, are quite solid. Yeah. So that's going to be an easy fix. Just need to replace this. Very strange, the, the brass split open and actually on both sides, so I, I guess it was a defective, uh, a defective one. That's really strange. So I need to find one now. So this is what the threading is supposed to look like. And that's what... Uh, so all this bit has been missing on the other one. So it was probably clearly a, a defective uh, a defective connector. So now I need to make the hole big enough to be able to put this and clean the pipe. The problem is that the normally to, in order to put um, a connector like this, I need to um, to pull the pipe enough to and make a clean cut. But as it's uh, it's buried uh, all the way, I can't really do that unless I cut a big slice and put two connectors. So I'll try to do a patch uh, to, with just one to begin with, see if it holds. And if it doesn't, I'll, uh, I'll have to replace a bigger section of my pipe. It's not going to hold because the this uh, the pipe is too old, and so it's actually a bit deformed where the where the old uh, seal was. So I can feel a bend here, and it gets loose around the joint. So um, if I fix it, it's certainly going to to either uh, pop out again or uh, or uh, leak through the the joint. So I need to do something else. And what I'm going to do is actually, um, 
Rather than replacing it with a straight joint, I'm going to put a T-junction and have, um, have another tap here, which I'll be able to use for, um, for uh, watering the, the plants, for instance. Seems like a better idea. Because the T-junction is a bit longer, so I'll be able to cut both uh, ends of the pipe and uh, get the, the grip a bit further where the pipe's not deformed. But the only problem is that I don't have a T-junction here. So I'll need to, to go and get one. So temporarily it's, um, it's a bit of a drive to get anything around here. So what I'm going to do is put a plug at the end of the pipe uh, so we can still use the, the water pipe for the garden and uh, when we go we'll replace it when we do the drive. This is my temporary fix, so there are uh, just uh, plastic plugs that I put on uh, either side of the pipe uh, just so that uh, I keep, uh, I can uh, put the water back in and also um, so that the, the dirt doesn't get in the pipes. And that should do.